I'm really wanting to know what it looks like up there. So let's jump up and have a look. Nothing too out of the ordinary. Obviously, got all this foil insulation. Doesn't look like it's doing too much in a lot of the places. A lot of extra cabling that's put in. I'm presuming they've moved it for that. Might grab a light. Boom. We'll jump up, have a look, eh? That's not a big ceiling, that's for sure, compared to the last house. I'm pretty sure all this has been moved probably from the fiery that installed the new smoke alarms. This is all fairly new. You have to uh, install new ones to be able to sell. So it's probably only been done in the last four or five months. Low insulation though. Oh. Oh, getting too old for this. <laughs> How do resi sparkies do this? Oh, used to do a fair bit actually, but it's been a few years. data through the place, most likely for phone points. It's definitely a poor job on behalf of the uh, smoke guy doing the smoke alarms. Uh, what's the point of having insulation when you're not gonna put it back? Down the other end, same thing. Nothing too crazy, bit of data out there. Same as this. Just taping it all up. See that cable there? That looks like the aircon, guys. Just going straight through. Love your work, boys. Oh well. Didn't find any snakes, no rats. I haven't even seen any. Uh, Rat poo around, which is pretty pretty crazy. There's a few bits of uh, rat sack around, but definitely no animals, which is pretty good. We'll make our way down and we will start disconnecting some of the power so we can start taking down walls. Ceiling. We'll go through and mark on the walls which ones are coming out. You know, the old, uh, tracer pencil. So this wall will be uh, where we going. Remove. guess of the cabling they've used in this house. I'm presuming it's gonna be solid core. 
It is an 89, so usually around that error and before is solid core, but we'll go have a look. We'll pull a power point off. I'll also turn the power back on and I'll show you an RCD tester I picked up the other day from Sydney Tools. It's from Fluke. It's really cool. I haven't used it too much, so let's give it a look. All you have to do is throw it in, turn it on. So it gives you all your faults there. It won't do your uh, earth neutral fault though, so remember that. But it's actually pretty loud. So if you go off to the board and you've got that on, maybe you're working by yourself, you need to know if that circuit's gonna turn off. I don't know if you can, can you still hear it? I can hear it. We're probably like two rooms away, maybe 10 meters. Definitely hear it. There you go. You know you've got that uh, circuit. So the other way obviously is to trip it while you're there. Down here, press the button, and she's tripped. Not bad. So I really hate these old school outlets. To get these off, if you don't want to reuse them, just hit them like that. Done. Done. There you go, the old coax. Man, that is way too bright. This thing is insane. That's on the it's on the top level, obviously. There we go, nice and nice and low so we can see. It's the old coax. The old grey cable and looks like it's uh, solid core. So it shows its age. Oh, and it's flat blade. There's almost nothing worse than a flat blade. A lot of people will say that the uh, Phillips is bad, especially compared to your Anderson or your Robertson, but yeah, flat is no good. So I'll give you a look at this. This is. Always brush my pliers against it as well, just in case she's dead. As you can see, we've actually got uh, stranded, stranded on the earth. A solid core. Let's see if we can get this solid core on the others. Sometimes demos got to be fun. It's definitely one of the uh, best parts. I really do like my job. Love going to a commercial site and doing the demo. So this looks like it would have been added after. Obviously, we're looking at stranded for that. Move from the solid core to the stranded. So as I figured, that's what that is. I have to come out later when we get rid of the door. There's actually a bit of rat shit on there. Oh, lovely. Look at that. Beautiful. Love the silicon, love the silicon. What's that even doing? Just because they've got a gap there. <laughs> Gotta love this. It wasn't coming off easy, but the old tap ins. It's the old solid.
So we will be most likely upgrading the board. What I'm actually thinking about doing is moving this whole thing around to the other side so that we can enclose this area. If I install on that wall down there, we can trench all the way down here to the shed, well, not to the shed, to the pool, to the pool pump, and then to the shed, rather than having to rip up everything down the side. And that's gonna have to be something I'll look a little bit further into. If you remember last week, we picked up these two out the back, they were fully submerged. So I brought them out, left them out there. They've been out there for a little bit over a week now. Fully dry. They're just full of crap though. Spiderwebs, ratchet. Look at the front of that one. But I did bring in a Makita battery, hoping, really hoping, that uh, we can get one of these working. That'd be fantastic. My, I don't, I, I really don't think it's gonna work, but let's give it a go. This will give Makita a damn good name. If it does. Oh shit. We've got a blue light. Not that that says much, that's just an LED. She's not looking too good. Got the blue light though. It's more than I thought I would. Now this one. Nah, not so good. This has got some charge on it. Too bad these things don't have indicators, these old ones. Oh, did you hear that? Do you hear that? Oh shit. We'll take it apart. I'm gonna have these suits best. We're using a key to drill. Oh, she's still full of water. What was that? That was a spider in there. Another spider just there, look at that fella. There you go. No, I'm an electrician, but I have no idea what I'm looking at here. If anything, that needs to uh, air out a bit more. That's soaked. There's a lot of water still in it. We'll leave it out for another, another week and give that another go. I really want to get that thing going. Throw it up in a marketplace, yeah? <laughs> 200 bucks, slightly used.